Hey guys, this is DC Lesh. I only had time to make a quick video for you guys today, but um, I think that what's in this video you guys will find rather interesting. These are some glitches and some things that I found in Five Nights at Freddy's, some things that I don't think have been demonstrated on the internet, and one that has been demonstrated on the internet. Um, and then one other thing that, that, that I, don't, I just don't think that anybody has pointed out yet, um, which is this right here, if you'll watch this little clip that I recorded a few weeks ago. Hey guys, this is DC Lesh, and I wanted to point out something. Uh, I was watching Markiplier's Five Nights at Freddy's reaction compilation, and I noticed something right as the first time the power went out. Um, as the power goes out, you see, like, here's the first, like, frame where the power goes out. The whole room goes dark, except for the lamp. Put lamp. Really? Lamp? Lamp! It's a uh, fan. The desk fan doesn't go dark yet until like half a sec- until like a fourth of a second after- not even a fourth, like an eighth of a second after uh, everything goes dark. So was this something that was intentional by Scott Cawthon or- was it something, uh, I don't know, was it like some sort of mistake, or was it, or was it this guy doing, doing something weird? Look at that face. Look at that face. Focus on that face. Was it this weirdo doing something weird? Now, I thought that it was just an editing trick, and then I went back and looked at one of my recordings for Five Nights at Freddy's. So if you look at that right here. See, it's this door is the problem because Fox, because Freddy's out there. As you can see, the same phenomenon happened in my video. So it's obviously something that was intentionally put in by Scott Cawthon, but for what reason, I can't really figure out. The next thing that I want to talk about is, well, something that has already been pointed out on the internet, but I thought I might as well go ahead and show it. Uh, this is a cheat code that will allow you to get to uh, the custom night. Quickly, and it was how and it was how I was able to show the last thing that I have to show you. So here is uh, the cheat code. Hold down C D two. When you do that, it will unlock the custom night. Now here's something that I found on the Five Nights at Freddy's wiki that I hadn't seen anywhere else on YouTube, and I'm pretty sure still hasn't been shown on YouTube. So I thought I'd go ahead and be the first to show it. So, in the original Five Nights at Freddy's, uh, if you let Foxy run down the hallway, something strange happens. So, here's how you perform this glitch. You wait until you see that Foxy has completely left Pirate's Cove. And then, you click on the left hallway and you see him running down the hallway. Now, before you put the camera down, what you need to do then is go back to Pirate's Cove, close the camera, open it again, and then when you open it, as you see, it will, instead of Pirate's Cove, show the office on the camera. Now this is very strange, I have no idea why this happens, but it's quite interesting to me, it's a very interesting glitch. Uh, you can go ahead and try it out at home if you want to. Um, so yeah, that's it, that's all I really have for you today. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and this is DC Lush saying goodbye.